was lying in bed this morning and didn't want to get out of bed. And then I remembered that it's our breakfast meeting on Tuesday. I was excited about that. We got a lot done in that meeting. <clears throat> That meeting was meta. We planned the next three years of our life. Oh my gosh, we are talking about some long-term stuff, you guys. <laughs> That's really helpful to me. It just helps me feel like I know where I'm going. I don't know, just getting on the same page of some of that long-term stuff was, was really valuable. We can't share about it uh, with you guys just quite yet, because it's still kind of like fragile stuff that we're trying to figure out. But I don't know, being on the same page with Cami is like, just huge. It makes a lot of the like minor like fights or disagreements or misalignments or even motivational struggles throughout the day and the week. It resolves a lot of those things when we feel like we're heading in the same big picture direction together. When you put when you start talking about things like they're actually going to happen and you put stuff on the calendar, it really makes it more real. And I just felt like these things are coming up quick. Uh, and I think when you don't do that, it's easy to kind of be in like La La Land and like, oh, I've got plenty of time. And part of me likes to be in La La Land, but I think it's also good to be in reality. We are heading to our ballet lesson. We haven't been to ballet in three weeks, something like that. I'm gonna have some cookie dough right now. And Ben said, well, you gotta vlog it. So I was, technically it's both of our cookie doughs, so I didn't wanna like eat it all without asking him. He said, well, you can have my half, but you have to vlog it. You have to vlog it good. So, here you go. If you've never microwaved cookie dough. Hey, that's fine. I would suggest that you would try it. I don't really like microwaves. I don't think they're that good for you, but. Then you can eat it. You wish I had a You wish I had a little. Hang on. For me. You blabbed it. You blabbed it. You blabbed it. You blabbed it. That was totally worth vlogging this experience. <laughs> Oh, let's leave that alone. Come on. <laughs> hey, look, look where they go. Look, these go here. Watch. He knows. These go down there. He knows. Look. He's hey, that. look. Mm -hmm. Let's put them back. Yeah. <laughs> The weather is so great today. Flea, what is going on out here? It's a house. It's a house? Can you show me the different parts? So look, we have this planter bed, but there's all these like bark, rocks, a plant, looks like parsley, basket. This is where it gets a little more intricate. You got rocks, brick pieces, little pieces of bamboo, nails. Bark with wood, with rocks, with more nails, <laughs> hair brushes, and then if we jump over to this bed, we got more colorful brick all lined up. Did you do all this? For whatever reason, when I come out here, I love seeing this stuff. It just feels like it's like, you know, making something out of nothing. Like if you don't buy the kids toys, they're gonna find ways to be creative and resourceful. And this isn't a preaching, don't buy toys, that wasn't the point of what I just said, but kids will make things beautiful and awesome out of whatever they're given. 
So I love how he, you just have like this garbage, basically. And how Flea has made this like, I don't know, stuff, it seems like that would like take like an hour. But whatever in their heads that they see, oh and here's the doll. I don't know if she's in like a timeout or if that's her little house. I mean, it seems like to spend that many hours on that just requires like so much like imagination. Uh, I love seeing it. But today is a great day for a uh, run! Feeling kind of sluggish. I wonder if it's the cookie dough. Flea and Eden are all the way up there. They are all the way at the end of the bridge now. I can't even see them anymore. Hey, Flea. I'm gonna go up ahead on the swings. So I'll show you guys that. Or, or, should I go on the swings? Or actually, I'm not gonna go on the swings. But I'll show you something. I'll show you the swings. There's these over here. Spike needles. There's little flowers on them. See? This whole bush. Alright, good job. Here you go, here's your stuff back. You want me to put it back on you? How come you have a rock? <laughs> What's up, Ari? I'm wearing my whole socks. <laughs> um, oh yeah, that one. Mm, yeah. Problem is, our teenagers are allowed to buy sugar whenever they want, so no. they tempt us. <coughs> oh, give that face again. <laughs> hey, 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 not on the laptop. I don't take the time to do this very often, but I figured um, I would just speak to the new people who have watched our vlog starting more recently. I, I always forget that there's like new people here. I don't know, it's just one of those weird things when you're talking to a camera, you don't really think about, it's hard to categorize like hundreds of people or thousands of people. But anyways, first of all, I wanted to thank you for showing up and I wanted to explain a little bit about what our vlog is about. We do, um, a daily vlog where we release um, videos every weekday, so five times a week, just showing people another way to uh, see family. And it's alternative in some ways you might find, and then it's fairly traditional in other ways. And that's uh, just our life, and it's a story that we have to share, and it's based on our belief system, and there's certain things that we've come to grow into and believe more and more, that we think if other people believe them would really help them. And our best way to share that is just by showing it, we think. Oh my god, I'm not nope. up without him even waking oh, up. Oh, someone so just tired. waking up. So I'm Ben and this is my wife Cammy, and we have six kids. That's our oldest right there. And that's our youngest right there. Um, and we've been doing this for more than a year, but less than two. That's our channel, it's called Fight For Together. The reason why we call it that is because we think that togetherness or relationships are the most important thing. Relationships with God, and ultimately all relationships with people teach us about our relationship with God. And we think family are the most important of those relationships. So we're just really trying to learn to operate in a way that's together with each other, um, with the hopes that we'll be closer to God. The ways that we do that, you can find if you like scroll around, okay? So we have, uh, those are our most popular vlogs. Uh, most, recent. Uh, most recent, sorry, most popular ones. Um, table talks, that's something else. 
And then there's topics, like we have sex, and money, and adventure right here, and marriage fights. Um, I just recently added this page, which is like shorts. These are some of my favorite ones. They're like little short films. You can watch them just on their own. So I'd encourage you to kind of like check those out. And then we have start from the beginning. So that's our first vlog episode. It's really embarrassing. But our vlog, we're not really good at the whole like how to teaching things. We're just trying to pick up the camera and film our day and barely get through it. Sometimes we have opportunities to reflect. But if you really want to learn everything about what we believe, you kind of got to start from the beginning and just watch them. Sorry, there's not a better answer than that, but that's just how it is for now. Um, or at least hop around to the ones that look interesting. But we're really glad you're here. We hope our channel serves as a way to kind of like inspire new thoughts. So you can just see that maybe there's hope or a different way or learn from our mistakes either way. Anything else you want to say? We're glad you're here. Right now, we are heading to dinner. Um, I made a fruit salad. I, I've never actually made a fruit salad before, which I know it's not really. It looks good. But then I just read the text message and it actually says um, not to bring appetizers, it says to bring your appetite. So I think I read that wrong. We're but, uh, achievers. <laughs> we're bringing our appetites and our appetizers. But let's head out to dinner. <laughs> it's kind of nice because we're going to our friend's house for dinner and it's just one, two, three, four doors down. Dang it, I knew I forgot something. Uh, we're doing a monthly live stream, which is for people that want to go a little bit deeper into understanding more of why we do what we do. The next one is scheduled for April 23rd. It's a Sunday night, 8 p.m. Eastern time. You might want to put it on your calendar. Hope to see you there.